Here's how I try to get really active little ones, whether they be babies or toddlers, to sit through a story that we're trying to read for them. First, you wanna to try to pick out a topic of a book that you know your little one's interested in. This is a little bit easier for toddlers and babies, but if it's a topic of interest, we have a much higher chance of your little one sticking around. Then we have to set our expectations. We are not gonna be able to read every word of the book, and we're honestly not gonna to get to read every page of the book, but here's what I do. Rather than reading all the words in the book, what I do is talk about the pictures in the book, what's happening, and then turning, even if it's a couple pages at a time, it's been like going at this, then this, and this, and then we want to make sure that we close the book, we finish the entire book, so your little one knows that there's a beginning and an end. So here's the very hungry caterpillar. We have the cat, uh, an egg lay on the leaf. <gasps> Big sun, oh, caterpillar's out and he's hungry. An apple, oh, three plum, five oranges, one, two, three, four, five. Oh, ate lots of food, ice cream, watermelon, got a tummy ache. Now he's a big caterpillar oh, and the caterpillar is now a butterfly. The end. So it can be really quick to start with and then gradually getting longer and longer with the attention span. Hope you found this helpful. Be sure to follow our page.